Welcome back to my channel. Today I did two shopping hauls, one from Target and one from BJ's. At Target I spent $206.26 in BJ's 108.72. So I'm just gonna, I put everything all together, so I'm just gonna start over here. And I'm gonna talk about the reason why I bought some different things. I'm um, trying to do a little bit of prepping for like, you know, the second wave of the coronavirus. I'm trying to like double up on everything I buy. So I got toothpaste and I was able to get $2 off this. So it ended up being um, $2.99. So it's like $1.50 each. And then I got 50 garbage bags, which is really good because that's gonna last like two months about. These are really fun snacks to have just whenever you feel like snacking or when you go to the beach. Then I got a backup coffee, two packs of pudding, one chocolate and one chocolate and vanilla. I got taco seasoning and chili for making, um, obviously, tacos and chili. There's a soup. And I got four butters, so I won't run out for a long time. Then I got these organic chicken breasts which there's 10 in here, so that's enough for two dinners because we have five people in our family. So that's really good. And then I got frozen broccoli with the cheese sauce on it. A 20 pack of soft tortillas. 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 How many, how many ways can we say it? Tortillas, tortillas, tortillas. So anyway, 20 pack. Because they're nice and they're fresh and you can, if you do a taco with this, that's enough for one, one meal is enough. Um, lemon bars. I just thought that really looked nice. And then I got some spices. Okay. Garlic salt, crushed red pepper, and Montreal chicken. And then I grabbed this. It says Tuscan chicken and vegetables. And I looked on the back to see what the recipe is. And I happen to have all of these things in my house. I would just have to take the chicken out of the freezer to make it. And then I just got um, American cheese and turkey. Then I got some backed up tomato sauce for the stockpile. Two boxes of spaghetti. I got my favorite iced coffee, which is really nice if you, if you put a lot of ice and the coffee and then just a little bit of cream. It's really good. Two loaves of bread. Okay. I got another pack of dog food and I was able to get... Um, I think cash back, I'll have to check my receipt. I think I got cash back and a discount. So a discount from the store plus cash back from Abada. So I think I ended up paying like probably about $5 for this bag of $9, $9 dog food. So bagels, which my daughter <laughs> tossed in the cart when I wasn't looking, but that's okay. English muffins, peanut butter crackers, and we've got Two cranberry juices, one lemonade, then a bunch of like seasonings, salsa. This is for making uh, Chinese chicken. Then I got one pat, one, one can of premium white chicken for making chicken salad. Two cans of oranges. Another tomato soup. Blue cheese dressing. I got orange juice. I got three boxes of Smart Start. I wanted to buy four, but my kids said that was crazy, so I ended up just getting three. And then instant maple and brown sugar oatmeal, which is like the best tasting one. A comfort food of vanilla wafers, which you could actually dip in the pudding, which would be kind of fun if you want to do that. That would be nice. And then apple cinnamon and strawberry nutrient bars. My son eats these for breakfast, and he just he'll like probably eat a whole box if you let him. And then we got huge pack of instant oatmeal 52 packets so this this is a really good stock for the 15, stockpile 15, yeah two gallons of of one percent milk right here and then i got the all natural coffee creamer i got a bigger size than i did last week so that hopefully this will last a lot a lot longer than it did the first time then i got apple cider vinegar which is which is really good for digestion and then two 18 packs of eggs. And this salad is really good. You can have it for lunch or you could have it, you know, before you have your dinner. And then this was like a really fun thing that I wanted to get. I just saw this and I was like, okay, I want to have that, um, which we have a jar of sauce in, in the cabinet. But it was just something like I saw and I was like, let me try that out. 
So yeah, so pretty much the, all this is for, I would say probably for, for a month's worth of food. And then also for starting to really stockpile for different things that are gonna be going on with the, with the pandemic, the second wave of the pandemic for the fall. So I'm gonna buy a little bit each week to stock up for that so we have a good supply of food in the house for the kids. So yeah, and then, and then next week I'll be hopefully making some cupcakes with my own homemade icing and I'll do a video on that. So please like the video, comment and subscribe and click on post notifications. And everybody have a great, great hurricane weekend. Thank you. Bye.